And I've been thinking a lot about that time um, when we were getting all of that advice right back at the, the start of COVID and how much we were afraid as leaders at that time because we're, we were being told that thousands of people were going to die from COVID unless we acted. Uh, and we were taking all of that, of course, in good faith. We were looking at the modelling that was being given to us um, as leaders. And being in devolved administrations, we were, of course, speaking to the Westminster government about what was going on at that time as well. Um, so I think there has to be a lot of reflection as to what happened at that time, um, because really we have to learn from this the fear, period of time. The fear was understandable yeah. at the beginning. It was. It was the way it was sustained. Yeah. It became apparent to many, many people long ago that there was another way of looking at it and another way of interpreting it, and that was simply flattened. And it was lockdown, lockdown, lockdown. It was. And when we tried to have a discussion in the Northern Ireland Executive about proportionality, because all of our actions were meant to, under the law, be proportionate to the risk and to the threat, um, uh, when you tried to have that conversation, then the people who were having that conversation and who were trying to balance up other health care issues, isolation, uh, our older people being left on their own for long periods of time, our young people not being able to socialise uh, and have that peer experience. I mean, my children um, were meant to be at university but were at home, etc., uh, etc. Et when you tried to have that conversation as well as the economic harm that was going on, then you were labelled as someone who didn't care about the health of the population. Yeah. Uh, it was a terrible time, uh, Neil, and I hope that when you know, people look back at that, they realise that actually we weren't taking into account all of the other harms that were going on at that time. And we should have been. We tried to.